So Fusion 360 and Vector Graphics. They don't always line up, so let me show you how you can fix that. Let me look at this logo in the sign in Inkscape. I want this in Fusion 360 and I want it to be in a center of something. So in Fusion, let's just draw a center circle. I mean, let's make it 100 for scaling and just stop sketch. So if we now go insert SVG, find the SVG, it's drawing two, and pick the same plane. It doesn't line up. So the center of the logo is not in the center of the circle. And we can't eyeball it. That will not be good enough. So just cancel. So how can we get the circle in Inkscape to be in the circle of the Fusion Circle? Let's do a new document in Inkscape. And go to Document Properties. Make sure it is uh, some easy calculation uh, size like 200 by 200 is fine doesn't really matter and let's make the circle make sure that whatever you draw also have some uh, easy to calculate sizes I'm gonna use 200 by 200 and also the text is not so important I'm gonna make it anyways because I like to use even numbers 100 uh, I mean I'm gonna use 200 by 100 okay there you go let's make that path everything object to path okay so to center these guys, you can always center it in Inkscape to the page. That will not help you at all. So what you need to make sure is that the center of whatever, in our case, uh, the, the red circle, you need to, the center of this circle needs to be in the upper left corner of the document. How can we do that? Well, this, the circle is 200. So let's move it negative 100 in the x direction and 100 positive in the y direction. Now, the center of the 200 by 200 circle is in the upper left corner of the 200 by 200 document. That's how you do it. So now let's just align this text to the circle. Like this, and save it. So let's go to Fusion and uh, go Insert SVG and pick the same uh, plane. Get your drawing. So there you go. If you scale this now, it will always scale from the center of the circle in Fusion. So you can make it the exactly same size. You still have it in the center. So that's how you do it. So now you can extrude this, these guys. Whatever you want. Oh, there you go. That's how you center vector graphics in Fusion 360 and other 3D software. Thanks for your attention. Hope that helps.